No copyright intended, not trying to be sexual, convention, no religion. Do anything to get my YouTube channel taken away from me. I'm going to do some quirky bubbles. Ah. Okay, I'm going to give you a little taste of what might be coming out soon for some of my next animation Wednesday stuff. I got this, because Beauty and the Beast was originally, oh, not originally, originally, but from Disney and animation. So I got the Beauty and the Beast Emma Watson on Becoming Belle. It's a collector's edition, the ultimate guide to Beauty and the Beast, plus the making of the animated classic, New interviews with Dan Stuvin, Emma Tonson, Angela L A N S T B U R Y, and more. Um, Thirty nine in the U S, six ninety nine in Canada. Displayed until six to seventeen. Think of the thing that you've always wanted. Now find it in your mind's eye. And fill in your heart, the beast. So, I'll be doing a little bit of reading some of this. Um, Beauty and the Beast. I don't know if I showed you the front very well yet. I haven't read this yet, so I actually don't even know all. Be our guest. Be our guest. Put our. Oh gosh, I forget the whole thing. Be our guest. Be our guest. Put our. Was it manners to the table? I dare to remake a classic by Bill C O N D O M. Me, mm, yeah. I've been wanting to see this movie, but I've known to go see it with, so I'll probably buy it when it comes out and probably be in love, because, and I bought the dress they had from Beauty and the Beast from this, from Hot Topic, I, oh, that was like my dream, to be able to wear Belle's dress every day if I wanted to. Be our guest. Go inside the new film. Just give me a little headlines. Oh, look how cute she is in her little outfit. It reminds me of like Bella's outfit, a little different but still cute. She looks pretty humble. Once upon a time again, Emma Watson would like moviegoers to please take note of her footwear. The new fairy tale, Bella and her father. We try to make Belle more protective and a bit more in charts of her own destiny. The new fairy tale, it wasn't about changing anything, it was about adding dimension to it. We give fans everything that they expect and more. The Master with the Castle Show book style. Dance for Dance. Dance for Dance. Hmm. Inside the Magic for Team Beauty and the Beast, Beauty and her books, on the set, into the woods, little town, it's a quiet village. I have no idea what that says.
And like I said, this is some stuff that I'll be talking about on my next animation Wednesday. I just want to give you a little taste of what's coming up. Singing praises. Did people really think that was pretty? Like, that's a huge dress. Giant hat. How would you walk in that? And how would your head? I would be tilting over, probably. It'd probably also give me, like, five more inches. Who's some buddies back together? I'm not even sure if I said that right. I'm sorry if I did not. A new talent on Belle. Reviving a role. Emma Watson is now 26 years old. Wait, 26 years old. Looking back, what do you wish you had known when you first learned you'd be playing Belle? You didn't sound immediate, though. You sounded brilliant about playing her. What was it that you didn't want to change about her? What needed to stay the same in both the animated and live action version? What did you want to change? What did you want to bring to the character to make her your own? I'm not reading all of those. An enchanted Amy. E N S E M B L E. M A U R I C E. C A N T E N Z A. L E F O U R. Dust on. I always got annoyed with dust on. Cockstorm. Mrs. Potts. Looming air. Uh, plummet. Plummet. P L U. M E T T E Media D Gardrabu Don't ask, I probably mispronounced all of them. I'm sorry. Mirror Mirror on the Wall Disney Herons Snow White Cinderella Aurora Ariel and Belle. Fun fact Ariel and Aurora were my favorite princesses growing up. Fun fact Jade's favorite princess is her. Fun fact, I don't even know if Jade watched all these movies yet. Snow White and the Seven Drawers, 1937. Cinderella, 1950. Aurora, Sleeping Beauty, 1959. She's called Aurora, Sleeping Beauty, and Rose. And I always got which one she was confused. Ariel, The Little Mermaid, 1989. Belle, Beauty and the Beast, 1991. People always complain about the Disney princesses, but the thing is... You gotta look at the time they were made and the time where they are supposed to be. Because, yeah, certain things they didn't do in the time they were made and in the time that the show was based on. Jasmine, Aladdin, 1992. Pocahontas, 1995. Milan, 1998. Now, it's not that I didn't like these movies. I love all of them. Milan is awesome. Pocahontas, I like. It's funny, whenever I take a Disney princess out, she's one of the ones that I get because I'm so, I'm a vegetarian. I believe that you should have, I don't know, people call me a tree hugger. Tiana, all oh, princess and the frog, 2009. I, I know a lot of people don't like her. And before you go, oh, you like her because she's uh, African American. That was one reason I liked her, but I love the movie and what it was based off of because it gave you a whole new story. And yeah, she is different colored than some of the other ones, but it was kind of funny because I at least, when I was growing up and I heard about it, people were so upset they would not go to the movie theater, wouldn't see it with their kids, thought it was a bad idea. I actually thought it was a great idea for a generation of girls who may look like that to have a character to look up to and also I mean I love her story period she works hard to get where she wants in life and she does her best to achieve her goals and she doesn't try to accept handouts throughout the whole movie she literally tried her best not to accept handouts wanted to really pursue her dreams herself and the only reason she even accepted any consideration of Hannah was because she was told she needed more or because she was a woman or because of her status 
And I just love the fact that, like, she worked so hard to get where she wanted to be. I know, I love, I like all the Disney princesses. I can see, I can understand the difference in each story. And yes, I've seen every single one. Snow White, Cinderella, Aurora, Ariel, Belle. Ariel and Belle I know the best because that's the ones I grew up with. Pocahontas, Jasmine, Milan, Princess and the Frog, Rapunzel, 2010. I actually really like all the Disney princesses. And Rapunzel's interesting. Even though it was hard first for me to really get into it. Because I grew up with the Barbie version of Rapunzel. That's right. That's how old I am. 23 and I grew up with the Barbie version of Rapunzel. And Merida. Ah, oh, Bray. 2012. Well, redhead. Crazy hair. Disobedient. On and Elsa. Frozen 2013. If you don't know who Frozen is, you have been under a rock. Moana. I actually just saw it this year. Around 2016, but I loved it, and I liked Your Welcome and the last song, Building the Beast. Yeah, that, I was sure they were going to mess up, but they actually looked like they did a decent job. Now, I haven't seen it yet in the theaters to really say, oh, they did Metaxa or Horrible. Alan McKean keeps score. What did you think when you were approached to work on this project for the third time, really? When you said it was a challenge, what do you mean? I'm um, singing a different tune. 1999. Okay, I do not know how she's standing in that. I would fall over. And how did she get in that? Like, she must have skills. How does a moment last forever? How does a moment last forever? How can a story die? It is love we must hold on to never say what we try. Sometimes our happiness is captured. Sometimes the place stands still. Love is on inside our hearts and always will. Minutes to hours, days to years, then gone. But when all else has forgotten, still our songs live on. That's actually really pretty. I didn't really sing it because I was trying to read it. Remembering Howard Asherman. So this is, you know, some of the stuff that I'll be going over. Oh my goodness, it's going to talk about the animation version too. And all the other versions of it. They have a lot of versions of it. And each version I find interesting and more interesting, like... It's like, oh, so this is how it got to be this. <gasps> oh, I actually, I'm going to sound even older now. I got to see the, I have, I have all of the extra ones. Beauty and the Beast, like Enchanted Christmas. I even saw Belle read to the kids, the TV show back in the day. Holy moly, I feel really old now. I even saw Hercules, the TV show, and Buzz Lightyear, the TV show. I feel old. Okay. So, I'll give you a little piece of this, and then save to kill you. But help, but it's nice to meet you. You're K-E-N-J-I-S-H-I-G-O song, age 36, blood type A. You start working for OTA Engineering after your divorce three years ago. And now you're trying to kill yourself with a razor. Right? We're here. To kill you. To kill. To save you. 9% of a person's life is premeant man. How we live, how we die. Much like our genes. These are all laid out by our soul's plan. Oh, ow. There's... One in every town. Hey, Dad, I won't ask you to make the shop cute or stylish or anything, but could we at least make it less, you know? Okay. We were on the air. Now we are off the air. Bye for now.